Welcome to episode 60. It's almost an assumption at this point that I'm going to board a new ship in the episode, so I guess we might as well keep the tradition alive, right? Let's get started. 7% hull. Thank you very much. Now, I just got one quick thing to do here. First, I have to make sure that my katana doesn't actually have any outstanding orders. Then I get up. Hello. Katana. What are you doing? What are you freaking? I said no outstanding orders. Ah, oh, shit. It's because it's because he's part of the defense force back home. So he's heading back to Heretic's End. So I need to have the order to follow the ship because he just threw me the hell off. Look. Here we go. And 30%. That should make the engine operational. Now I just teleport onto the bridge. Take command. Now I have my very own behemoth. Thank you. 37. I transferred 44 over. And 37 are still alive. That's not bad. I only lost seven Marines in that operation. Pretty good. Let's see what happens when I try this. In Tarkachua, Raider. You know what that means. Do -do 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 -do. Hello, target. What are you armed with? Hunter, 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 Fusion Burst, Flak Artillery, Sea Wiz, Hunter, 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 Fusion Bursts. Wait, you not have a large turret on the front. That's weird. All right, so there's just really not that much to uh, to take out, then, is there? That's my big concern. Come on. There we go. There should be a turret on the bottom. Let's see what we got for weapons. A whole bunch of hunters, if if I'm not mistaken. M 
Unless we'll tell him to board now. Combat effectiveness should be very weak. I'm okay with it being strong, I guess. Um, should I go with very strong? That way I don't have to take the shields down. Although, I don't think this one has um, terribly fast shield regen. It's just that very strong is super slow. And it could be a real difficult thing. Yeah, we'll go. We'll go with medium. I'll go with medium. Whatever, and we'll send over all the veterans because we can. Warding resistance. Oh, you know what? Um, yeah. Start operation. Lose menu. Looks like he's got thirty veterans. Uh huh. So that would be the extra challenge if I was using all re recruits because 30 veterans will mop the floor with recruits, but I'm sending in a lot more than 30 veterans. Um, so all I have to do now is a keep this thing's turrets and engines down and B make sure that anybody who comes in to help destroy it, uh, takes off and doesn't bother me. Wow, he's got a prisoner. It says prisoners one. Really? He's got a prisoner. Wonder what purpose that serves in the game. Hmm. All right. Boarding teams preparing for launch. We need to damage the target first. Let's take the shield gen out first. have to be really conscious of my heat. Oh. There we go. Wait, why does it say there's a medium hunter turret on the front? That's a large turret slot. At least it should be. What oh, bizarre. Got us his engine. I can keep that at bay real easy with just one Mason at a time. Oh gosh, we've got lots of defense drones over here. As long as they don't, like, come over this way, that will be fine. Uh, boarding pods should be any second now. Oh shit. It's it's a freaking Argon behemoth. Stop shooting my boarding target. Confirmed. Thank you. Whew. Uh Did you not hear me? Stop shooting my boarding target. Affirmative. Thank you. Stay in formation. Thank goodness for that mod. Oh my gosh. Steady. Content. Making preparations to breach. Alright, the 
should be the fun part. Steady. Contact. Making preparations to breach. Oh wait. Wait, wait, wait. Target held very strong. So, I don't remember what I said it to you. Er. Oh, I said it to medium, which means I am going to have to damage the hull myself. Alright, let's do it. In car Kachua, Raider. Get him down to fifty percent. Boarding pod in Carcachua, Raider. That should do it. Stay in formation. Alright, well, I don't care as long as there's no, like, more of you guys coming to help out, because that's the worst part about boarding, honestly, it really is. Alright, so this is the last boarding pod. Steady. We're making. Okay, here we go. Stage 2 is in progress. So for engines that are out, they sure make a lot of noise. Go, move it. Okay. You are free to engage. Space debris. Here we go. <laughs> now, the moment Asian. of truth for this operation. Let's get them. Defending crew 65, and a lot they of them were veterans. Engage. What do you have, like 30 veterans or something like that? Boarding resistance 1300 still? And my <laughs> attack strength is 6300. Yeah. Now there's only 10. Two! There's only two. With 109 resistance. 100. Wow, 60 resistance for just one person. How about that? That's so very cool. Alright. So now... I have... Big Raider 2. And... Big Raider 3. Thank you very much. With 200 veterans. I wonder how long it'll be before they're elites. Because those veterans should have got some experience, right? Oh, well, that's nice. I got two new capital ships in the span of minutes. Because I have a feeling I'm going to need them. I thought there was a phoenix, a scale plate phoenix somewhere. I think it got away. All right, let's see if I have anyone following anybody. Big Raider 1. What's Big Raider 1 doing? Oh, it's following this Demos. I completely forgot about that. Man. Well, there's no fight around here. I wonder if I could... thing is, it's an ally. This is a Paranid Demos, not a, a Holy Order Demos. I wouldn't mind so much if it, much if it was Holy Order. <laughs> I mean, it'd be cool to have, believe me. I don't know how much it would hurt my rep to uh, actually attack and take it. I mean, I'm at plus 22, which is very nice to have, but I don't know. I can't buy ships at this Argon Wharf at the moment. Is it because it's damaged? If 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 a shipyard or wharf is damaged, can you not buy ships? Hmm. 
don't know. I can buy them down here. I need to replace Quasar 5. That got destroyed a while back. And I also need to replace an Explorer for um, setting up satellites because I, I am going to need more satellite placers. We've got Buccaneers that for some reason destroy satellites, which is very bad. I can use Elite Vanguards for that. Is there a, a scale plate up in Silent Witness 12 or Family Ticker, if I remember right? There's supposed to be one. Just one of the. Yeah, here we go. I really need satellites up here. Oh, you know what I need to do? I need to actually start researching on the weapons used for the gauntlet. In order to do that, I need to take a look at the weapons I'm currently using, which are large starburst shockwave and large heavy electromagnetic plasma cannon, HEMPC. Let's do those first. So headquarters, management, um, can I help? Mm -hmm. Blueprints. Why can't I select blueprints? Do I have to be there in person to do this? Because I thought the whole point was that you could do it remotely. Oh, it's got cancel research, so I've already got one going. Over and down. Which one do I have going? Blueprint engines. Right. Yeah, let's do that. So, calm again. Blueprint research, cancel research. Confirm. Then, um, can I help? Blueprint research, select blu blueprints. Equipment, turrets, more, more. Terran large HEMPC, that's one of them. So let's Task do that one started. first. Why does it say engines? It's not engines. Really? What is it actually researching? It says blueprint engine. But I must already have the um, materials on the station. That's really strange. All right, well, in 11 minutes, I'll have that. I do need to bring this katana back home, which means running the Xenon's gauntlet. Oh my gosh. Yeah. They still got the two eyes. I mean, I can try it. If I'm piloting it myself, I can probably do it. So let's do that. You know, I mean, it is on the loop. Technically, as long as you're not thrown off the loop, you should be fine on a medium ship. Yeah. Entering Ooh. system. See that wreckage? Choice. That's brutal. Autopilot disengaged. You know, actually, I can. I can just let autopilot. Oh my gosh, that's. Oh wait. Where's the other eye? Oh yeah, there it is. Because I noticed the other eye has 18% hull, which is good. But look at the wreckage. It's just ridiculous. We'll take the katana and Hello. just let you go back to headquarters. Yep. Good job. Thanks for your help. I'm going to hop into my Irukandji. I want to do this mission. Security decryption system. Do I have one of those on hand? I have 25 of them. <laughs> oh, yeah. As long as I'm thinking about it, the behemoth really needs a repair. Do you have anywhere we can repair? Oh, I know. Let's go. To, we're really close to the Vigor shipyard. Let's go here. Oh, dear. Yeah, look at all this stuff. Man. All right. So we'll repair <laughs> 1.75 million credits to fix all the shit that I broke on this ship. Or I could just let the crew do it. I mean, isn't that how you really meant to do it, really? Is that... Hang on. Who's... This, this is where you, you get the real challenge of figuring out where your experienced crew actually is. So if I say display skill for role service crew, and then I sort by skill, I can see that I've got oh, wow, a fair number of elite or specialist or whatever they're called in my really old ships. But wow, why are these on those ships is the question. So, like, let's let's move some of these around. We have seven specialists on Digger Six. <laughs> move them to the Behemoth Vanguard. I have six specialists on Digger Seven. 
move them over. I really wonder why the Behemoth Vanguard only has 44 crew slots in it. For such a big ship. 44, really? Entering system, windfall. Oh, neat. I don't think I've ever actually walked out of the ship. Hello. All right. In an air kanji, apparently you walk out onto the wing, which is pretty cool. So you can just walk onto the wing and off the wing. Like so. Pretty neat. It is a fairly small ship. Anyways, let's do this mission real quick and get that scratched off our list. Look what I just found. Look what I just found. I noticed this little um, compass, like an architect's compass a symbol here, and I clicked on it, and it says that they're willing to pay 30 million for me to build a defense station. Yes, please. I'll take it. What is, who's it for, anyways? Um, oh, it's in Windfall. Oh, this should be so easy. I mean, there's there's like... Not gonna be any conflict. It's it's right here, and windfall, and you know it's for the vigor syndicate, which might actually you know improve my standings with them. That's always nice. So I will absolutely accept this one. Now that should show up here, and according to this, they it says that they want they want five defense modules, one dock area, one pier, thirty two turrets and eight shield generators. Oh. I've never built a defense station for somebody. That that sounds easy. Because, you know, the gauntlet was a lot more turrets than that. Five defense modules. That would be like the disc, right? And, yeah. I'll have to design this sometime um, when I'm not playing. And then we'll see what happens. That should be fun. This particular Incarcacho that I captured this episode is very important and you'll see in a few episodes why thanks for watching catch you next time